Hello guys. Um, in this video, I will try to show you uh, how to suicide in trading stocks. You know, um, I have some people who still send me private messages and some they comment and they say, Oh, I don't use stop loss. I'm good. You know, um, it is in trading and in investing, it is a big problem to be stop born. I'm trying to, I have done a lot of videos about stop loss and how important it is in your trading and investing. And some people, uh, some subscribers and some viewers, they send me a private mes a message and they try to argue that stop loss is useless. Okay? Now, I ask them, are you making money? You say, no, I'm not making money. Even, someday they say, I lost money last year. Some they are even. Okay. You are even or you lose money. So, why are you trading then? It means why you spend the whole year trading and the outcome is nothing. You waste all your time. If you have a part-time job, you could make tons of money the whole year. So, um, this is suicidal thinking. It means you think that you are right although you are wrong. And you continue with this behavior and you think that one day with this behavior you become a big trader and you become or you you will make money from the from the market. The market we have two kind of forces that if they join together they kill your position okay now suppose that a stock has gone from ten dollars it goes to fifty okay and you see that the stock is very good the whole last year it goes good so you think that it will continue like this from fifty to one hundred or eighty and you make some money now you should buy it yesterday. Let's say you buy it on Thursday. On Friday, there is a big sell-off in this stock. The guy or the guys who have bought the stock last year and a lot of people joined and buy it and, those, and, uh, and this price goes from $10 a share, it goes to $50, is the whole year work. A lot of people, they join, a lot of traders, a lot of swing traders, position traders, and they make the, the price bigger and bigger and bigger until it reaches 50. Okay? Now, those those people who initiate, who buy the first, who are the mutual fans, most of the time mutual fans, after one year, they want to get their profit. So they hit the stock with a sell-off. You see, for example, 5, 7, 10, 15, 20% loss of this stock in one day because they want to get rid of it they take their uh, their profit and they go to another stock mutual funds you know they change each year uh, the stocks now the second force I'm talking about is short sellers short sellers are day traders okay they don't they don't do like uh, what we call swing trading or they don't do position trading they do day by day if they find a stock that in the morning they see stocks that are going down because someone is selling they see the orders coming they are selling big orders not just uh, 100 shares it is for example 20,000 shares in one order 50,000 shares it's coming the order are coming to sell so what the short, short, short sellers do? 
they sell all, all the other shares that are not sold and the people they hold all the stock so for you you buy a 50 and from in the morning from 50 it goes to 30 for example it happens always in the market it's not something you, that's why I told the guys always subscribed and other viewers the market is always the same from 19th century until now it's the same some stocks go up some so go down and they short them that's it it's something common and what is the thing that will save you tell me there is nothing that saves you except when you use stop loss and second thing you don't put all your money in one stock these two things if you do in in all the trades that you do believe me you will see the money okay regardless of the stocks that you are choosing except I, I always say penny stocks they are very very uh, risky so you risk too much why should I buy a stock today and the stock is each day is volatile it's 20 percent 30 percent up and down why, why should I do that why should I lose 20 percent or 30 percent of my money in one day I'm not crazy people are looking for 1% loss, not 50% or 20%. Some people, they still argue with me and they send me comments, they send me private message, and they say, okay, I don't use stop loss. How are you trading? Who shows you this kind of trading? Who? Just tell me one of the big traders that say, that say oh, I don't, I don't use uh, for stop loss. Tell me a book, a very big trader okay that says no I don't use stop loss okay so it is a real a real a real problem if you want to suicide in terms of money don't put don't put a stop loss okay I don't I don't show you how to suicide in real life because you do wherever if you want to suicide okay this is your life now I'm speaking about your money right now so I ask all these people to wake up and some people they still believe in investing the stock is, is 50 and he invests in the stock it goes to 40 oh he stays it goes to 30 he stays he's investing two or three years four years it will go up now who tells you that this stock will go up who tells you that this company stock because the company has no relation with its stock believe me like if if a stock if, if a mutual fund sells the stock off almost all the shares okay as I give you the example and the short sellers they short sell it they sell more shares of other people it's not their shares and because they cover later okay so where where is this kind of investing? Who teaches who teaches you this kind of investing? Who? There is no one who say this. Even if you read the books of investing, they tell you you should see where you want to get to exit the trade when the, you know that the company is not making any difference. I have seen many stocks that 20 years it's the same price. 10 11 15 15 14 13 11 9 8 10 12 13 14 it's the whole 20 years so what is this and they say oh the company has good fundamentals earnings are good uh, the uh, they make new things the store is, is nice the cus customer service is ex excellent the management is excellent Customer service, you call them, they, they answer you and they are polite and they solve all your problems. Yes, it's good to have a company like this, but it's a stock. Is it going up or down? Or is it stagnating, slipping stocks? This is what I call them. Slipping stocks. Stocks that, ha that never wake up. <laughs> they never wake up, they never walk. They never, they never even creep. They always in a coma do you know what is someone who is in coma he is not dead and he is not living he is in between 
these are the, the stocks and some people they believe in investing in these stocks okay investing is like trading if something is not going up don't buy it whatever they tell you whatever they speak in TV whatever the guys in the uh, in the guys in TV shows on YouTube in books whatever they told you stock that is going down buy it they are wrong and they will be wrong all their life because they will never make money okay so I repeat again if you want to suicide don't put stop loss I have explained many times I have done many videos but people st stay stubborn okay they are stubborn they can't make money because sometimes they make money in one in one uh, in one stock by chance but the market because they know you you are not a good trader it will smash you because you are doing the same mistakes you do as before okay let me drink some coffee so I repeat again stop loss is very very important that's why we make the plan for the trade why do you make the plan of the trade when you want to buy the stock why you buy it okay if you buy the stock is, is the stocks going up do you see any sign it's going up if the stock is trending into a range for six months ten years one year ten years twenty years the whole life why you buy this stock because they you read an article some stupid analyst put an article to promote the company and they say the, the company is good so buy its stock and it will go up because and because and because this is what you are looking for um, I don't know I don't know people from where they get their knowledge to trade or to invest but it is catastrophic you know it is catastrophic when you see that each year you lose money and you do and you don't do nothing to correct your mistakes and you think that you are right this is the problem this is a double problem okay double problem you make the mistakes and you make another mistakes not to correct your mistakes so it's a double problem okay it's two kind of mistakes one is worse than the other you do the mistakes and you don't want to correct your mistakes two mistakes at the same time and this kind of mentality this kind of behavior you will never I I, I put it here you will never be a good trader okay even if you get uh, some money like 10% or 5% or a year or 1% you will never see the money because you don't want to learn okay I give you here for free okay I'm not asking okay go buy my book or go my training okay I'm doing something a lot of things here on on, on uh, buy free and because for me in the past when I was a beginner, I don't find someone who teaches me or I find videos that tell me the truth about trading and investing. All what you see is people who teach and they don't trade. These guys are too many online. Okay, You just go and put trading or investing, you find hundreds of people speaking. But they ask them, do you trade? Have you an account, real account? How much money you, did you, are you making money some they even they can lie you know because they they want to sell you something they say, okay they they try to lie or something but you you will understand one video second third fourth and you see what they say and in the truth it is not correct what they say so for me sometimes I, I, I just go to some people like this and they see them what they are doing and I give my opinion okay my, my opinion I tell some people that are teaching I I told him you you are not a trader and you have never traded tell me the truth he said me a say okay I'm teaching uh, I have been taught by uh, 
in the school or uh, or some firm and I am promoting the broker so I am teaching webinars like webinars and the brokers okay if the broker I, this is an example if the broker knows how to trade why he doesn't trade okay why he teaches you to trade and he doesn't trade because he knows he doesn't want to risk any money he, does, he doesn't want to invest he doesn't want to trade because he needs only your commission and fees from you that's it if you trade a lot he will make money and he will be happy that's it he, it is his business okay so this is all for uh, suicidal thinking and some people uh, I, I get uh, some messages they do day trading they stay glued in their computer the whole day it's 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 amazing okay if you want to trade you should need a lot of knowledge and you should have good capital you don't you don't you don't have to stay that much did you see my video about um, day trading about Facebook and Twitter? Okay, twenty-five minutes for Facebook, I get six. I, I get uh, sixteen hundred dollars. That's it. I do it live, and when I when I do it live, I publish it right away in one minute or two. I publish it as it is. Okay, this is what. what without any indicators without any fundamentals without anything i look at the chart i put my strategy if it, it doesn't work i have small loss that's it this is this is the real trading you can never it's a trade you make money never you lose some money but since you lose just a little bit each time when you win other trades that will cover the loss and you will have a nice profit okay we are not here having a machine to print money in trading and some people you go online and you find some people um, uh, like printing money and um, this is for for, to, for tonight for this uh, suicidal uh, uh, suicidal uh, uh, thinking and uh, and stubbornness people are stubborn they don't want to learn and they ask you a question you answer them you are stubborn you have an attitude you should change your mindset in order to trade open your mind for other uh, learning process it means opportunities learn a new thing then you will get or erase all what you have and start a new strategy start a new way and maybe you can make money okay that's it for tonight thank you very much for watching if you have any questions just ask thank you